Well, in Tucson, man, the atmosphere was fabulous. Sold out crowd, family weekend, all the vibe going, and the Oregon Ducks were the ultimate party poopers in that regard. A dominant performance, 580 yards of offense, seven touchdowns, Yogi. And I tell you, Bo Nix is captaining one terrific ship so far. Well, he's the story, right? I mean, he's got such mastery around what they're trying to do offensively. He does it every which way. You saw on the deep ball to Chris Hudson, you recognize there was no middle safety, no problem. Want a touch ball? Okay, Chase Cota, the only place you could put it. How about another one? High and away from the defender, Troy Franklin, too easy. And this is just what he's done throughout his entire football life. Almost 30 rushing touchdowns now in his career, and not just QB sneaks, QB design runs. Like, Chip Kelly, UCLA, I'd imagine they've already started watching film. Yeah. you got to figure out how to slow down right. Bo Nix. i got to say, look, the offense is easy to, to cluster on. Five straight wins for Oregon, 40-plus points in all of them. But they slowed tonight what had been a very good Arizona pass game. They, their game plan was phenomenal. Keep Jane Delora in the pocket. Play a mixture of coverages and Christian Gonzalez. What he did against Jacob Cowing was impressive. What Brandon Dorless, Mace yeah. Funa, this front did to just really get after the offensive line of Arizona. They had no chance all game long. I think it was the most complete win for Dan Lanning. Wow. Both teams have a bye, and then UCLA goes to Autzen as an undefeated team in two weeks' time. Let's yeah. get the signs ready <laughs> from back in the day. Let's go. Hey, Tucson, the Ducks. Again, 580 on offense, seven touchdowns, all rush touchdowns as they really deliver a punishing blow to Arizona.